Okay. Well, the game decided to crash out as I died yesterday. But it looks like it set me back up about halfway through the room, as opposed to starting me uh, back at the save location. Which is, on the one hand, a little unfortunate, because it does look like it's after my incident uh, with the uh, fire jet in the middle, so I've still lost about half my health. Hold on. Is it worth it? Because it looks like these flame jets are so aren't expanded out the way they're supposed to be. I don't think it's worth uh, testing to see if that's just a display error. Yeah, definitely not. Jet blast. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Walked into that like a dumbass. Okay. So. I can't access that panel yet because I don't have... I don't have the battery, so I need to figure out where the goddamn battery is. I don't know. circuit breaker I need to interface with. I guess there's no guarantee that the battery is in here. Let's go backtrack just a smidge. Anyway, uh, right, hello again. Doing more my new Dead Space run because I freaking love Dead Space. And I'm having a very good time with it. I died a couple times because of dumbness on my part. No, oh, can't move that. So I'm guessing the battery's not going to be in there. Defeated all of the horrifying monsters in here. Investigated this. Okay. Well, I don't know where the missing battery is. Basis is recharged. So that's not going to help. There's the. I guess they don't call them juggernauts. What do they call them? Big guys. Something. I've forgotten. Um. All right. Now I think the battery is in that room, and I just wasn't seeing it. I am going to go in here and lower the sound just a little bit more. Because I don't always speak my loudest and I was being drowned out by the game just a little here and there. I noticed upon revisiting the stream. So I just need to find this battery. It must be in that room. I've gotten my ass burned off a couple times now, as I'm not being as careful as honestly I should be. Um, and for some reason, when I got killed uh, yesterday, uh, it uh, crashed the game uh, instead of reloading me. Right, this is new here, so let's drop you here. Uh, not do the same thing that almost got me killed yesterday by walking straight into the jet by forgetting it's there. Grab you. Drop you over there. No battery. You up to block the fire that is being properly animated. 
And no. there is still no battery in this corner. supposed to be down there. Not there. wishful thinking. Emergency fire suppression system. Oh, wait a minute. It is pa an idiot. There wasn't a battery to find. The circuits just were completely unassigned, so I all I did was waste time and health. God damn it. <laughs> I just place. Oh, cool. Uh upkiss. the free stasis recharge because now I'm half down on my stasis. I don't love that. Alright, well, sorry about that stream. I feel like a idiot. Wasted health, wasted time. I actually kind of hoped that, because uh, it froze up when I finally burned myself to death and it was reloading the checkpoint. I thought that it was going to return me to my save location, uh, which was before I'd lost all that health, but it didn't. So, now I get to live with the consequence of that, which is, you know, fine, but a little unexpected. Who's going to drop... Hammond? Another malfunction. After the issue in the red. Someone get the door open. Hammond? Chin? What did that thing do to you? Kill him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Holy fucking hell. That's incredibly different from the original game. That just looks like a flux capacitor. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, this is also the part of the game where we lost Hammond. There was a big puzzle to get the this core. It just looks like a fucking flux capacitor. 
so they took away the puzzle. Him and Vitals, they just flatlined. He. Him is gone. Him and shit. Oh my god. Warning. Cascade failure in all primary systems. Fuck! The Valor's gonna blow! Go! I am going. Warning. Primary systems failure. Evacuate. Oh, wow. Well, now I'm really... Warning. Really... Primary systems failure. They're going to be... Evacuate. Must be... Kind of... Selling... A part later, Warning. but differently. Primary I'm interested to see how failure. it's done. Evacuate Go fast. Some of it back. Alright, we need the light gun for this. They're really just nothing. So, like, this is very cinematic and fun, but in the original, I think you were on a timer. Like, you had five minutes or something to get off the ship from the time that you took out the Singularity Core. So they've gotten rid of the timer, which is nice, just because it could be a little unforgiving. But I do feel like it reduces the urgency a little bit. It makes things more cinematic, but reduces the urgency. Ah, rewatching the stream the other day, I saw that there were a couple tubes I failed to look into. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. That could get you killed. Oh, grab it. Oh, God, that could have splattered you. Is that the antenna? It is. You grabbed the antenna. In the original game, they played a lot more heavy-handed with the idea that um, Hammond was sabotaging things and working with the Unitologists and all that, and, uh, you know, were was very much at odds with... God, I'm so bad with names. <laughs> okay. 
Alright, well... That health is lost. That's fine. I'll live. I've been through worse. End of days! Three chapters left. This one and two more. anything in here that was like secured with a higher security than I could have. <gasps> That's right, I said that I could pick up that action. Yeah! I did remember correctly. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I need to get to a store. I'm going to be overloaded. myself I would get some screenshots of the newer better graphics since I have a bunch from the old game on my computer. But none yet for this one. Double check the break room for right this break room. The uni break room. Well no nothing there. Stuff. I miss the upgrades to the, uh... With of the line gun that would make the uh, lasers on the side one point further and further out as you went. You'll see that pop up a couple times as I try to grab some interesting pictures. Oh boy, that's not good. There's a store and a bench here. Is that what's unlocked? It is. That's what's unlocked. And that's the way I want to go. And it's the way they want me to go. Isn't that, like, lucky? Look at all this money! Alright, let's get rid of all... like pulse rifle. Let's get rid of all of these. That to storage. Okay. Storage looks like that. Yeah. 
56,000 credits. Okay. Since we have 56,000. Get four. I feel fine buying those. One of these. And this. Yeah. 36,000. It was 35,000 to buy the last suit. So the next suit is probably going to be about 50,000, if I have to guess, which I do. I don't remember. But that means that... It not be that hard to get them up. About 14,000 away. Now we're going to go over to this bench. Yup. Five power nodes. Alright, suit. The only thing we don't have is stasis energy. Let's just go ahead and grab that. Four power nodes left. The Ripper gains. Ripper blades gain an additional ricochet, and Ripper blades gain an additional ricochet. Well, I already managed to shoot myself in the face with a ricocheting blade once. Line gun. Okay, speed and increase laser damage. That would be two of them. Whereas the plasma cutter has capacity, damage, rate of fire, back prone. Right. So with these four, we could get all of these and only be missing out on the capacity. Or I could go one, two, three, four, and skip out on rate of fire and being able to knock enemies prone. Which is... Oh. I've only just realized I had the camera covered this entire time. It's fine. It's only been covered for 22 minutes. I'm sure. No one will notice. Woo! Woo! Excuse me. Sorry about that. Or I could pump it all into the flamethrower. We get damage, capacity. Capacity, capacity. Or I could get damage, capacity, load, and damage. Which does seem a better way to do it. Find out how much damage you gain. So right now the damage is 65 points. Five points per. That's not super awesome. Well, we made it slightly better. <laughs> it ain't nothing. We get capacity damage and capacity or capacity damage rate of fire or rate of fire special damage. What is such a nice round number? Alright, 22 capacity, and our damage is now maxed out at 200 points. Alright. Love the plasma cutter. Love the plasma cutter. I say, I say, it's a spun using a line gun. I love the line gun. Alright. Reality is, I love the line gun most of all. I wanted to go this way again for quite a long time. Again is the wrong. Definitely heard some shenanigans going on. Yeah. 
them. Area seems all together for the exception of that strange barricade. Right, out we go. Hell yeah, I can finally get that log. Let's see what pops out to try and eat me. Who's gonna try to eat me? Are you gonna pop out of the floor? There's a doorway. Oh yeah, they're very willing to let me miss that. Alright, grab this. I think there was more body chunks underneath the box. Oops. Oh, wow. That is the worst. I think actually that fell down and crushed this person. Or, remember they were the barricade that were blocking me through, maybe? So maybe they just flew from this direction? Oh, maybe not. Oh, I don't like that at all. Bye. I regret picking up that baby doll. <laughs> that guy one shot a bunch of them. At least two. I love the line gun. So much. Alright, yeah. Looks like it was just two. But yeah, you aim the line gun right, and it's like... God. It has so much energy, so much damage. Just carries its way through all these enemies. So good. Oh, Benson's rig. Ram Supervisor Benson. And some money. Alright, well. We got rid of the evil baby doll. I one-shotted my way through two necromorphs. Which always feels good. feel powerful because I just came back from the Valor where I had to fight some nasty things and I come back here where, uh, you know, they're not armored and decked out with a uh, stasis field to make them super fast. Got my, my low health unarmored civilian model uh, necromorphs. Ah, Used up everything I had at the other bench. 38,000, though. 38,000 is always good. Isaac, I'm losing you. Daniels. Something on the crew deck must be interfering with the signal. I can guess what that something is. If the marker's active... Shit. The crew deck is locked down, but the deck supervisor might have an override key. The last location I have for her is the gym. How long will it take to install the Singularity Core on that shuttle? Not long, if no one tries to stop me. Hurry! We can't leave the marker in their hands. God, I remember. You have to go to the gym and play the stupid gym game. Uh, throwing the ball through the rings. You know, while necromorphs are attacking you. Station now accessible. Because that's where they, they locked up the, uh... That's where they locked up the thing. In the gym locker. I'm an area. 
Oh, I'd almost forgotten about this part. Everybody's been blindfolded and had their heads beaten in. To prepare them. That's always a good sign when they start giving you stasis packs. Ooh, burger. Ah, service. Quality soda, sun soda. It's time, infidels. I hear people. Somebody's talking or moaning. In a nearby room. Can I? Oh, good. Yes. Oh, shit! I'm sorry. I have to desecrate your bodies because I do not want a bat coming in here and making my life difficult. And honestly, nobody made you choose the cult. You did this yourself. This isn't even my fault. I'm just not going to let you become liabilities. I got a leg. Not acceptable. You. You still got a leg. Unacceptable. I'm sorry. I know it's horrible. But I just... I can store the extra stasis. It says it only costs one rack. That's good. Because that costs 25 fuel. That only costs one blade. That's... Uh, okay. Ooh, storage. Ooh, I have a lot of fire. I can switch back to fire for a bit. Okay. Now that... Oh, no. There we go. Okay. Nope. I keep missing bodies. That, or they keep generating new bodies, so that there's always something in here for the bats to screw me with. That's possible. Look, I swear I'm not crazy. I'm not just desecrating corpses for the fun of it. It serves a very important purpose, and that is, it keeps me from dying. I, I have to desecrate the corpses. It's not really even a choice. It's just the way things have to be. Not that way. A locker room? 
a shower. You like loud? Oh, God. All right, let's just simplify things. It'll feel less like individual desecration if I make a pile first. It'll feel less bad. Level 3? Yay! <gasps> Lyrax, yay! Pneumatics. <gasps> For the new suit! Money? Okay, we're immediately going back out and getting the new suit once this room is done. I'm not even going into the next room. I'm not risking it. I'm going to get the new suit immediately. Some Ripper Blades. Alright, everybody in the corner? Good. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. If you don't look down and remind yourself that it's bodies you're just destroying, you know, it's not so bad. There we go. That feels like I got it all. Yeah. Yeah, I think that took care of it. I do also still love the kind of mingling between function in this game and uh, and 2, where uh, Isaac really didn't have a voice in the original version of this game. But then in 2, he got a lot more of his own personality. He got a lot of voice lines. I didn't even notice those. I don't think they're going to become a problem. But, you know, I'm, I'm used to eating crows at this point. I don't think they're going to become a problem. Alright. New suit, new suit, new suit, new suit, new suit. Level 5. 60,000. I absolutely called that wrong. I thought it was gonna be 50. And so if I hadn't made the purchases I made, we would have the money for it. But you know what? It's just... 20,000. Oh, God. Okay. Alright. That's fine. I don't get to have the level 5 suit just yet. I'll just have to go find some more money. It'll be fine. It will be entirely fine. We'll find some more money. We'll probably have to desecrate some more corpses. But, you know, price you gotta pay, right? In this economy... It wants me to go that way. But, I think there was another door here. There it is. Looks like I got all the important stuff. Oh, is that the ball? Not you. Nope, that is not a ball. <clears throat> that was not the ball. It wants me to go that way. Oh, okay, so there were just two ways to go around. Alright. Oh, is this the same hallway? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Then all I did was prevent myself from missing the suit. Yeah, there's the game. You gotta play the game. This will probably tell me that I have to play the game. Use the Kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the ring before the timer runs out. Beating each level yields a reward that can be claimed from the lockers when the center of the ring lights up. Target uh, that ring for a score multiplier. Play ball. Yeah. And you are required to beat one level of it, I believe, because the first level gives you, like, the key you need. But where is the battery? Entering zero gravity. Uh, it used to be you were launching yourself from platform to platform, which was kind of key to be able to quickly reposition Entering and change gravity. what you're aiming at. So I guess one of the one of the rewards must be the battery I'm missing. Uh, huh. I don't think they're gonna stick a battery in the locker. Is it just floating around in there? Entering zero gravity. Mm. No. Oh, 
Oh, there's the battery. Keep you over here. Green. I heard the ball release. Hello, babies. Fire seems ill advised. I know, it's okay. I got babies to defeat. Ow! Stop shooting me! Die from the damage over time. problem here is definitely- wait. Oh, fuck me. It used my big one! Damn it. Oh. Uh. Damn it. I got the battery. High score is five. Okay. Um. I don't have to play the game. All they need is this battery. Yep. Got that. That didn't unlock. Uh, is this what I have to do? Excuse me. I want to read this. Um. Theme. Oh, I was hoping that I would actually be, like, listed on there and know what I need to do. Alright, let's see if, uh, four... Entering zero gravity. Challenging than the original, actually. Multiplier. Multiplier. The red one might be. Oh, there it goes. Bunk.
Look at me, Z ball. Oh, that definitely extended my time. Woohoohoohoo! Zinged it in there. Right before it closed. Three hundred white at the buzzer. <laughs> I also seem to remember there being more items floating around in here for you to just grab, more than just the battery. Oh well, doesn't matter. I did the thing. That makes everybody happy. Look at that! Six levels of locker. Did it all. I skipped the kill house on the Valor, so I guess I kind of owed this one. Oh man, a bunch of ammo that I'm not gonna. Okay, that was worth it. I got the Ruby Semiconductor. That's ten thousand right there. I got a free uh, node. That's another ten thousand. I really need this table to get the fuck out of my way. You know, I don't feel a need to go back through that room. I, I'm not proud of the things that had to happen in there. Other than to say, at least no bats will be able to go in there and screw me. Forty-two thousand. But now we've got all this ammo. I don't want this. Yep. Force energy. Bye. Yep. Contact energy. Bye. And these. Five thousand. All we need. Five thousand. That's it. That's all we need. Five thousand. That's like a couple money pickups in random locations. Easy. The save, because I'm an amazing Z baller. Being a cheap and for getting 300 right at the buzzer. Three seconds left for that last ball. Got it in right as it struck zero. money? Come on. Eek sauce. No. Wow. Look, I'm sorry. I can see that things went very poorly here. Still have limbs attached to bodies, which means that you are a danger to me. I don't like things. Do I just go straight back down? I do. Wow, that, that's it. Aim in here to get the, the key card. Through key card. And that's it. Like a like a bath, I'm just going right back out. Okay, well, whatever. I don't like hanging around places. That's seriously just 200 money. It really was. Be back out. Oh, that'll get me through the locked door in the atrium. Okay. That makes sense. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh. <laughs> I didn't listen to my instincts, and uh, I paid for it. Sometimes that happens. But using the flamethrower means that none of the goopy gabbers came out of them. So that's good for... Really? Come on. That's probably a bat. It is a bat. Yeah, there's nothing for you to infect in here. What about two bats? Man. It's almost like I knew. It's almost like I looked around and I saw piles of bodies that you could turn into necromorphs and said, you know what's probably going to happen? Is they're going to turn these piles of bodies into necromorphs. And to that... I say, no, no, I don't, I don't like that at all, not, not even a little bit, 56, anything available. No, but I sure can chew through flame ammo. So much for going into the next part with the highest level suit like a badass. Can't always get what you want. Sometimes it's just too expensive. Logging security card. I use the security card of a dead person. Oh, okay. We'll go first. Down we go into the bowels of the ship. Down we go to where we can die. Fight some zombie. Maybe they won't kill us. I built your ship. It didn't work. You're not gonna hurt anyone else. Temple's alive. Run out. Mercer! Still alive, Mr. Clark. I'm still denied convergence thanks to this ingrate. Mercer, wait. Tell me. I want to understand. What is convergence? But you already know. Dead or living, we all feel the markers to don't you want to be reunited with the people you lost? I... Yes. Then why not it me? Mr. Temple has fused. But we are so close. Everything... His eyes moved. Not fully frozen. When you put it that way, you... And your marker can go to hell. No, no, no. He's gonna shoot Temple. He's gonna shoot Temple. If you tell him that, you needed to keep him talking until the stasis ran out. At a slow death. Stasis. I think your death will come faster. Oh god, it's the hunter. Which means this is worthless. Money. Stuff over here. That's, uh, 
Here's the next thing. Get me more notes. Notes. Nope. Damn it, is that it? Is that it? Nope. 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 Getting back up. That's it for now. Nope. Got no reason to be hearing Chen's voice, that boy. But if Objective updated. <laughs> ah, something in Uniscript. Cool. Gotta love it. Ooh. Oh, a few spiky looking spines. Okay, well. Let's go that way, so. Orps said I'm sorry. Oh god, no, not again. did not just do that. Wait, 
now? We're just gonna go down there? Hold on. Ooh, excuse me. Hold on. I originally wanted me to go through this door. There's no power. Can't go through that door. I seem to remember in the first game there was stuff inside the bar at least that I could take, but not this time it seems. There we go. Down we go. This will be fun. Oh yeah. John Carpenter's the thing up in here. Just call me Childs. Very dead. Very recently dead. Those organs are still nice and gooey and alive looking. Money, a store, and a bench. Alright, well, now I know they intend to kill me soon. Money. God, it's only a hundred at a time. This is crap money. Chump change. I can always chump change. Alright, let's get that new suit. Still can't afford the suit. Because I've been getting chump change. That's okay. Because I actually can afford the suit. They give me anything I could sell? Nothing I really want to. Alright, shop. So, give me my suit. Hell yeah. Now I'm all kinds of armored up. Less damage from hits, right? I'm pretty sure that's true. to either size or energy. Energy is a good idea because we are uh, down by one. Any uh, down by two, three. I think we've only got two left. So that's probably the best one to go with out of all of our current options. So let's do it. That gets us some free energy. 
Bam. Now we've got six stasises. The only thing it's not giving me is say. And I beef me up and then get me killed so that I have to do it all over again. Glass. Nope, that's just a door. Wait, I have to save. Rubber blades. Ah, oh, power node. Fucking sweet. But for now. No. You Mercer. Fuck you. You're here talking to me. All this is bullshit. This is bullshit. Well, I thought I was gonna have a big fight. Nothing has come to eat my face. Yes. No. no power. Battery needed. Sorry, buddy. You got dealt a bad hand. thought about leaving through the other door in the room and then I forgot. I was thinking too much about the fight that didn't happen. At some point I gotta find the fucking nodule that's good. Look at that. And, you know, I bet if I had the force gun I wouldn't have to move each object one at a time. Just be like, kerblam! Put him in a corner where you're not super in the way. Crack this pipe. I had asked myself, I had asked earlier, you know, how come those pipes glow if they're not interactable? Turns out they are grabbable. Oh, cool, poison. No oh, shit.
Stripper blades. Fun. Forty seconds. Of hey. Stop stopping on that one. Thirty seconds. Oxygen. Oxygen. Buddy, I just need you to sit still a second. now, but it works for me. Is back. I don't like using up that much ammo, but much through there. I guess I just keep there. I guess it's yeah. Okay, that door was blocked by the goo. I think. Lovely line again. I know I've used a lot of ammo, but it's it'll be okay. Probably. It'll probably be okay. Okay, well, I still forgot the battery, so uh yeah, I guess I have to go back into the poison. I think I was supposed to find a battery in there. go into areas marked storage room, as that is exactly what they are. They store supplies. I can help you. Like the battery. Fuck. <laughs> Almost overlooked it again. special, right? Today's dinner. Breaded. Tank grown halibut with potato fries. I mean, 
I would have expected that they were tank prone since they're on the ship for. Oops. Well, that's what I get for thinking about dinner. I get to waste two wine gun ammo. Yeah, I think that's my. Yep, back in the bar. Okay. in here. The marker is there. And active. Okay. Killed that. Let's say locked. But are they locked because you're about to do like a talkie thing at me? No. Hunter. Alright. Well, up I go, I guess. I go. I don't see any no. The nodes are all in other rooms. to the person doing the violin right there. <laughs> Quite the odd solo they've been asked to do. I think that the effect would have been more scary and less, like, make me pay attention to it specifically and think about it as a piece of music as opposed to a piece of ambiance if they'd had a couple uh the violins kind of grating against each other right there instead of one person doing it solo. Alright. 8,000. Nothing really saleable. Okay. It looks like, honestly, I should be using the Ripper. <sighs> this weapon has been nothing but trouble ever since I got it. Like, to the point that it nearly got me killed. Actually, yeah, it nearly got me killed, uh, in the, uh, in the section where I had to control the ADS to shoot the Leviathan off of the communications relay. What's happening? Find the shuttle. You need to install the Singularity Core. Isaac! I know what I have to do, Daniels. There's a lot of ground between me and the shuttle, and that ground includes Dr. Mercer and his hunter. Maybe trust that I'm doing my job. and a bunch of smalls. Let's use the smalls. Alright, I've got two mediums and two smalls, and I'm doing fine on health. Power. I 
wouldn't have been hurt so much if I hadn't been using the Ripper. If I had just using the weapons I'm actually good with. General Nexus. But is, is this not the area I've been through before? This is where I came from. Yeah. Or I just came from. Alright, so I'm removing that next. Let's do it. Aren't you dead? That's what I get for trying to stomp the hunter. It just beats the shit out of you while you're in mid-stomp animation. What? Go back? Are you kidding me? I just opened that door, apparently. Stay down. armored ones. Battery. 
battery. Pick up the battery. That's a problem. Stay. No ammo left. Stupid thing. We got doors and lights. Doors, please, obviously. Lights don't... Oh, God. That's it. Just some ripper blades. Nothing else. Ripper blades and a person who hanged themselves. Please give me something better than fucking oxygen. <laughs> now you're just having a laugh. Clearance level. Master security override required. That's money. Gimme. Oh, giving me shit I don't want. I've learned. Can't look to give horses and mouth. Have to keep ammo, even for guns you don't like. That's one of the devs' idea of a joke. Oh, it's all the severed feet standing. What the hell? Head and arms. Here 
as helpful as I'd hoped it would be. The, in the first game, the room that I was in that had the woman who was laughing until she blew her head off, um, originally that was a sliding wall puzzle. you had to try to complete while the hunter was chasing you. Now, seems like it could be. He's over here. racks were grabbable with kinesis. You would have to slide them around. But they aren't this time. So, yeah. No puzzle like that this time around. Don't you look at me. Baby. Draining my resources out of ammo for all my best guns. I need to use the restroom. Sorry. Sorry about that. Oh. Effectively getting out my best ammo, so all I've got is a stupid ripper. Ah! Ugh! Hey, there was money there at least. <laughs> I didn't see the goddamn fire extinguisher until it was too late. And then the fire extinguisher set off the explosive device I brought with me. That is just... I deserved that. Good gosh. Well, I can't blame that on them. That was all me. Security check in. Oh. 
Another one bites the dust. Sell things, buy things, try not to die. Survival came at a grim cost. Classics. Let's put on one of the fun uh, cosmetics they gave you for buying the sword. Have it up toward the end anyway. Those are hands. Oh god, those are hands. <laughs> I don't I don't think I can do that. I don't. Let's go with this one. I, I, I can't walk around with a hand oh, there's a head stuck to my butt. Nope. like a Dead Space 3. scenario. Oh, we're using the dumbass buzzsaw. Because that is how it must be. Okay. Away we go. Kind, kind I rather like. He's not perfect. He's trying, goddammit. Fire! Another banana. Here to phone. Another security check in. Ah, 
There we go. The executive suites. Captain's past of the Ishii Bora. It's a war importance. CEC shareholder pamphlet 202. Do not distribute? Hmm. What is planet cracking? Planet cracking is quite literally the dismantling of planets and moons on a macro scale by dedicated vessels known as planet crackers. Entire worlds are fractured with gravity tethers to reveal the rich seams of valuable minerals contained inside. These fractured pieces of debris are mined, processed, and then shipped to their destination. You may have read environmentalist reports claiming the destruction of a planet can disrupt, can destroy, let's see, hold on, can destroy an entire solar system due to the disruption in the gravitation forces that hold each celestial object in orbit. Some of the wilder reports claim this causes, every time I move it I lose where I was, this causes the whole system to spin out of control, or planets to smash into each other. We would direct concerned investors to the article Safe and Sustainable, CEC's Pledge to the Health of Our Galaxy, for a detailed breakdown of the truths about planet cracking. The short answer is, planet cracking is perfectly safe and provides an essential service to Earth and the colonies. Out of over three dozen planet cracks, only one operation has met with less than optimal results. Critics often cite the Wenat disaster 11 years ago, where in a planet cracker, three supply ships and a colony were lost due to a gravity tether failure. They rarely mention... See, it happened again. I moved it and I lost it. They rarely mention that since that time, CEC has strengthened relationships with our manufacturers, committed to regular crew training seminars, and implemented safety protocols to ensure a disaster of that magnitude can never happen again. Before each planet crack, the candidate worlds are carefully chosen for their mineral content, net worth, and safety with which they can be dismantled. Planet crackers are also invaluable for harvesting asteroids and rogue planetoids, which present a deadly risk to expensive infrastructure and installations. Planet cracking, a detailed breakdown. Planet cracking is a lengthy process, typically spanning from three to five years. Generally, the first year is spent prospecting and setting up a planet-side colony. To minimize losses, these colonies are intentionally in a light... are intentionally a light outlay in terms of infrastructure. The next 18 months involve tectonic excavation, gravity tether maintenance, and related planet-side activities. The planet cracker arrives between the 2.5 and 3 year mark, depending on the progress of excavation. Once the ship is in orbit, preparation for tectonic chunk extraction begins. This takes approximately one week. The removal of an excavated chunk from the planet to a stabilized geosynchronous orbit usually takes about one day, 24 standard hours. During this process, billions of tons of debris break off from the underside of the chunk, creating an instant asteroid ring around the planet. While the floating debris is extremely dangerous, planet cracker ships have an excellent asteroid defense, or ADS, system to keep the ship and crew safe from harm. For more information on our proprietary ADS technology, see accompanying literature. This process is repeated until the entire planetary body has been broken up and processed. Smaller bodies, such as asteroids, are drawn into the mining bays and processed directly, using direct processing beams to reduce waste. As you can see, the profit margins of planet cracking vastly outweigh solely planet-side operations, which may not be profitable for decades or more, and represent massive outlays in terms of personnel, infrastructure, equipment, and insurance costs. About us, CEC, Concordance Extraction Corporation, is the largest solar mining and extraction company in the Earth colonies and the fifth largest interstellar company in terms of market capital. Since our founding, we have become a powerhouse of industrial might and a major cross-system employer with a generous budget allocated to election spending. Oof. 
the EC has always been able to maintain a strong market position and secure political support thanks to our dedicated lobbying bureau. Yay. So good that in 400 years we won't have fixed our lobbying problem. The EC owns over 400 deep space vehicles, including five planet crackers, with the famous USG Ishimura as our flagship. The EC pioneered the scan and catch technique, which is now a staple of asteroid mining, and was the first to implement shock point drives for commercial use. We are the largest supplier of precious metals to commercial interests across the inhabited space. We take your financial security and the well-being of our employees seriously. When you invest in CEC, you are investing in a future we can all believe in. CEC, powering humanity into the future. Ah, uh, yeah. Gotta get that tasty, tasty, sweet, sweet investor money. They gotta feel safe investing. They gotta know their money will be safe with you. Want me to go there? Oh. Oh, good. Well. Well. <laughs> Another text log. God damn it. To Captain Matthias from an unidentified center. Subject confidential. Fleet position confirmed. To Captain Benjamin Matthias. Referencing our pre departure discussion, I am blessed to report that the vested have authorized premium stasis, cap uh, premium stasis capsule for you aboard the Church's Holy Fleet. Congratulations. Your generous donations over the years have already covered all post mortem stasis and cryopreservation fees. While I cannot guarantee which arc will safeguard your physical body, all fleet vessels are designed for centuries of deep space operation and equipped with a state of the art defense technology, ensuring that convergence will proceed without interference when the holy hour approaches. I must reiterate that this birth is conditional upon successful completion of your pilgrimage. Once the marker is safely delivered into church hands and all electronic records have been appropriately amended, I will be pleased to finalize your resting place among the church's most blessed, including Altman himself. As if they have this 200-year-old man's body. Praise be the marker and its prophets, Phoebe Tremaine, Sanctified Messenger, Fleet Selection and Security, Church of Unitology. All correspondence to and from this individual is monitored. Disclosure of any information in this message is heretical parties. To heretical parties is strictly forbidden and punishable by seizure of property and or excommunication from the Church of Unitology. Well. I don't feel better for having been in here. And I can't even mess up their stupid... Fucking, oh no. Well, that wasn't worth it. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. nope. Come on, fucking text logs. I just would like to listen. Personal log, D. White, First Officer. Goddamn unis are running the ship. So far, I know for sure Captain Matthias, CSO Kine, 2SO uh, two Mercer, LCDR Holt, Carrillo, Pitts, Red, Maynard, Shand, Espaleta, Natividad. That many senior officers just happen to be marker heads? Can't be a coincidence. I know a stack deck when I see one. Update. Check some files. A lot of those reassignments started after Director Eckhart got chatty with the captain. Since when does the C-suite give a damn about personnel? Uh, since they believe that uh, they're about to get the marker and do the convergence thing, you know, 200 years of persecution or whatever. Two more journal. Oh, uh, well. 
Wait a minute. That looks like me and Brennan. Oh, I can't grab it. I can't be sure. Let's open these. Fine racks. Okay. Security okay. card required. Bolt. And second officer. J. She oh, this is Sheik. Okay. That was white. Who was the first one? That was Matthias. Oh, good. The creepy room with the. Wow, you can see it from out here. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hm
somebody's base wall there. I don't know if I'm expecting to find another body in here, but not. No. There. Really, just to get a power node? That doesn't seem likely. Those aren't mission critical. Totally actual. I only need to go and remove that from bathrooms, and I could leave, but I chose to stay and go through the other rooms. Gotcha. Alrighty. And blue spoon, blue spoon, spoon, blue spoon. Yep. Interesting that there don't seem to be any unis hanging out with the marker. I would have expected that to be the case. Alright. Things didn't go perfectly, but left halfway down on my stasis. I've got a medium health pack. I don't know if I've got anything to sell. I don't. I start selling Ripper Blades, which honestly, I don't want to. That weapon. Probably find notes to get into the next chapter. Cluster behind you. Not yet. Not if escape on that shuttle and you'll kill us all. When they took the marker from Aegis 7, it woke the being in the core of the planet. I don't know if they ever showed me that ahead of that happening before. The hell is that? Mercer calls it the hive mind, nexus organism which controls these necromorphs telepathically. If we leave while the hive mind is active, well, you saw the valor. If even a single necromorph escapes, humanity is finished. The marker. Amelia, she knew. She told me it would return the beast to its slumber. Okay, so if we return the marker to Aegis 7, It'll stop the outbreak? Exactly. But we need the shuttle to return it to the planet. You have a singularity core. And I can let you through. So what do you say? If it'll end this for good, deal. Excellent. I, I, I can distract Mercer, but not for long. And get the marker to the shuttle bay quickly. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Clearance confirmed. 
<laughs> oh yay, more ripper blades. <sighs> Can't see when I It was only a voice at first, but now she is my constant companion again. I had forgotten how much her presence soothes me, and as always, she sees to the heart of the problem. The marker must be returned. Perhaps there's been some kind of accident, some severance? Do the marker and the hive mind always coordinate, or can the hive mind slip the marker's influence somehow? Regardless, if this theory is correct, if the two are now at odds, if the marker can quell the hive mind, it would cut the puppeteer's strings at a stroke. It seems obvious in retrospect, these necromorphs have no intelligence, how could they? Yet, there's clear, if rudimentary, purpose behind their actions, especially the gathering of corpses. They're clearly following some drive to kill living organisms and gather biomass. But where does this drive come from? How does it command them? Do all necromorphs convert by, converted by a marker share this? Bond? Pact? Instinct? Or is the hive mind demonstrating a genuine telepathic communication, perhaps the first ever observed? How painful to admit that the marker's horrors still hold fascination for me. Now I think I understand my predecessors, those who first studied the black marker rather better. The road to hell begins with unprincipled curiosity. Foolish, foolish, foolish. I should have known sabotaging the engines was only a stopgap. Are we returning to Earth? Is the marker falling back into the church's hands? Yes, Amelia. There are always alternate solutions. Always. Alright, I'm not gonna blow that up just yet, just in case uh, it decides to drop a bunch of shit on me. Not while I can spend some nodes. I have three. I can increase my error capacity. Size of the stasis field. And the duration of the stasis. That honestly seems the most useful of all three of these. Rate of fire capacity. Special, which lets me knock things down. And nothing. I didn't get the other two upgrades for it. Damage. Wow, its damage is crapola. Alright, yeah, we're just gonna finish up the suit. Alright, suits 100% upgraded. That's what I'm doing. Never should have brought the board. Amelia! This area clearly belongs to Kine. Inquiry tasks. Seem to have been assigned to Kine. Claimed it. I spend ammo. Back the way I came. So the way Kine went is totally cut off from me. That has immediately happened. Let's see how long that holds up. No save box. There is one back in this area, so probably okay. That freed the marker. Now I should be able to abscond. End of days, two chapters after this one.
Oh, what are you? I got. I should honestly stop holding them up the way I do, now that I've got so goddamn many. I should just start flinging them. Oh, okay, it's not my health, it's my proximity to the marker. Stupid. Okay, so. Well, you need to use Mark went that way, shuttle's over there. This is the part where I finally get rid of the hunter. Get on the shuttle. Ugh, marker. Don't like you. I was not when I grab it. Stasis recharge. No door. Spiky. That's locked. There's stuff in there. Access. Yeah. Means I get on the shuttle. Yeah. Explosives. I think I positioned things for the moment. This is a lot like the ship we came in on. Singularity Hall replaced. 
Test fire shuttle engines to complete hardware installation. Yeah. Test fire the shuttle engines. Get rid of the hunter. Didn't do nearly as much damage to me as I was worried it would. Get wrecked. wait for the reload before I could fire my stasis was just fucking oh fuck god damn it Jeff Mercer yeah I killed it fucking suck it doesn't work like that yelling at the marker isn't gonna do anything That's so much more fitting in end for him. <laughs> oh god, I think I just cracked my helmeted head three times. Can I? No, not yet. Uh, I don't like being pulled through the ductwork. This sucks. Jeff! You let me go, you bet. Oh, this is not the right weapon. Ah! Corners! Shimura's screaming. Critical damage to internal systems. The marker just ripped right through the ship. Something pulled it down to the cargo bay. Kind, pilot the shuttle to the hangar. I'm going after the marker. Of course. Amelia, quickly. Wait, Dr. Kine. That guy's lost it. He killed the captain. We can't trust him near the marker. He says returning it to the planet is the only way to end this. We've got to try. I'm heading to cargo. You ping Nicole's rig and tell her where to go. 
Leave it to me. Thanks. When I get the marker, we're all getting out of here. End of day is complete. Second to last chapter begin. Alternate solutions. That's exactly what he had told his dead wife in the fog. Always alternate solutions. And I got pulled here. Wait, it wants me to go that way? This goes back to cryo, though, doesn't it? Yeah. It does go back to cryo. I remember that thing that looked like a bank of a server rack. Guess if there's any overall stuff here in the cryo. Jesus, this is so tanky. Tanky. So many corpses. farther away, and I'll just shoot them at them. Ah, oh, a weapon upgrade for the line gun! Yes, yes. Yes. Uh, well, Mercer's finally gone. Oh, it's letting me go this way now. in the hangar bay. We'll meet you there with the marker. Yes, Amelia Sue. We'll send the hive mind back into the darkness. So glad you gave that guy our only escape shuttle. Shit, Isaac. Those things you've killed, their biomass is pulled down in the cargo bay. It's recombined itself into... Well, it's something huge, and the marker's embedded right in the middle. How the hell do we do this? I've got Ishimura's cargo crates. They can move half of the mining gear, no problem. If whatever's down there wants to wrestle for the marker, I'm in. <laughs> so confident. Work, hurry. We're losing critical systems fast. Back in medical. Bench, yeah. Twenty-three thousand. Line gun upgrade, a photon energizer. 
the amount of everything <laughs> except for the uh no healing. I don't want to spend ten thousand on healing when instead I could get a couple of nodes. It just feels like now is the time to go find those lockers that I didn't have access to before. Files awful. One. Clearance confirmed. Oh, stuff is stuff. 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 A lot of these places are interconnected, so, like, even if you start going the wrong way, eventually it becomes the right way. Where I had to claim Ben's rig. It's time. Here's that. I think it just let me go around in a loop. It doesn't say make a U-turn. It goes, okay. You wanna go that way? You can go that way. Hi Derek. We're getting Emergency. towards the end now. Internal hull breaches detected. Yeah. No. Oh, 
probably wants me to hop on the tram and head to the cargo bay. wanted me to take the tram, but then I didn't take the tram, so I can just get there. Kind of sleepy. Boo. Hey, heels. Up we go. Looks like I pretty much visited everywhere around here. Emergency. Deck evacuation protocols are in effect. Oh yes, oh yes, oh no. There's only like three people left on the ship, uh, so whatever. Let's go! Let's light this candle, shall we? Totally done. We're good. Might have been the stasis thing over there. Uh, there's always pang. Oh. Containment fields approaching. Okay. <laughs> did that actually take up an inventory? It did. Pang. Valuable and oddly intriguing artifact from the past. Sell at a store for credits. All right. Well. I found that. Oh, 
the above. What do you got? Plasma energy? Nice. Still don't have the Master Override. There's Master Overrides all over the ship. I'm not gonna find them all. Okay, wait. This part rings bells now. I remember having to do this in the original game. Oh yay, Ripper Blades. My favorite. Always want more Ripper Blades. easy. There we go. Activate. Retrieve cargo. What else we got here? God, everything sucks. figure it out on my own. Loading shipment 782. Beginning retrieval. Beginning retrieval. Oh, there it is. I guess I didn't need to do anything. <laughs> it was just telling me that it sucks at its job and it's doing other things. you see all the loot I have to deal with? That isn't loot. Oh, that's why it's glowing, because they're impaler rods. Caution. Access bridge yeah, is I'll deal with it. Transfer. Give me a sec. Got a locker to open. After that, I can run D&D tomorrow and leave the stream open in hopes of getting you another viewer. Okay. <laughs> have a good night, buddy. Boop, 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 boop. Well, that didn't do any good. Access bridge is obstructing transfer. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Back off. Ow! Bastard. Caution. Access bridge is obstructing transfer. 
there anything down there I can grab? No. Oh. There we go. Huh. This is a lot like the ship that I have to do down on the planet. Oh crap! <laughs> well, that's about the worst thing I could have done. I accidentally stuck the laser trap to it, so it was linked to me with the laser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get there. I'll fix it. I'll make everything better. It's what I do. Oh. That was what I needed to do. Still don't have master access, so I can't do anything with this. I need to go this way. Why did you not pick that up? Look, it's not my fault that you had to follow a fucking circle over here, okay?
emergency. Internal hull breaches detected. Told me to bring the others. Probably Mercer. Probably. That's all the healing. Just in case. I want to use a save, but I feel like there's a zombie gonna get me.
back from the start. Quarantine lifted. I keep trying to fight things in melee, and I really... God, I'm learning that that does not work. Just... ever. I keep thinking, well, I've hurt them a lot. Maybe it'll work this time. Hey, buddy. Entering zero gravity. a lot of things in here toward the beginning of the game. But I think I won't have to mess with them. Uh, get everything I want. Marker. Get this puppy moving. Out to here and I'll have to rotate it. Gonna need that battery. Let's just follow the procedure then instead of trying to skip steps. Yeah, it was the one other breaker. 
Rail track, loading shutter. Well, rail track seems to be what I want powered right now, so. Air, okay. Not super useful. Now. Rotate that. Uh, ah. I control it from here. Bam. Okay, again. Bam. Easy peasy. Oops, I stopped it. Where'd it go? There it is. that battery was in there just in case I didn't have There it, was... it is. The marker. The safeties are still on. I need to restore gravity before we can load it. Hurry, please. I'll grab this and take it with me. Just in case. Fun part! Fun part of the game is the ending. Cole, is she here? Oh! Fuck! I couldn't have seen that coming! Aegis 7 was off limits. The planet was one big government experiment. The marker, this divine artifact, it was built by human hands. That's impossible. It's an alien world. The miners dug up the fucking thing. After it was planted here a few hundred years ago. Even kinds didn't pick up on that. They found the first marker in some crater on Earth. That one. That was real. Alien. Enough to inspire unitology. Our people studied it and reverse engineered this red marker. But they needed somewhere to test it. Aegis 7. You've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. I thought the old reports were just hysteria. Until I saw what I saw. They sealed off the whole system, buried the records nice and clean. Until CEC got greedy. Those idiots tore each of seven apart and woke up with the old research team left behind. So Earth Gulf sent you to sweep it all under the rug. Damn it, we have to return the marker. If anyone else stumbles across each of seven. It was disappeared once. We can do it again. I've seen how the marker fucks with your head. It must be contained.
for what it's worth. We made a great team. You'll find another way off the Ishimura. I mean, you're one hell of an engineer. Your experiment's gonna kill us all! Daniels! Yeah, but getting off the Ishimura doesn't really help me, and I just gave her a shock point drive. Nicole. Where are you? In the flight control room. Please, you have to come up here now. There's still a way out for us, but we don't have much time. Bring in this battery. Just in case. I think it's just a spare in case I had it done with stuff earlier. But, you know. All personnel proceed to your designated safe zone immediately. I really hope Nicole's not in here. This area is lousy. Everybody blowing their own heads off because they see a few nightmarish hell creatures made of their former friends and family. Weak. Nicole. You made it. I tried to find you. Half the issue is coming apart, and the other half swarmed with those things. How'd you get here? You cleared the way. I can always count on you. Not this time. Daniel screwed me over. You couldn't have known she would take the marker. She left us to die. There's still hope. You can recall the shuttle and remote pilot from here. Bring back the marker and we can return it to Aegis 7. You can make us whole again. I just don't know what to believe anymore. <laughs> it's okay, Isaac. He never responds to her no, saying that. Flight control. How do I use this? Recalling shuttle USG09. Prepping remote docking procedures. Damn it, Isaac! You don't know what you're doing! I know! Someone's gonna answer for this! You fucking kidding me! Shit! Warning! Escape pod launch detected from shuttle USG09. Well, where the fuck she Escape thinks she's gonna go? Damn! We lost her. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. But who can? <laughs> oh. I didn't tell you to do that. Reprogram the shuttle with our flight path to Aegis 7 and join you on board. You'll be watching my back. Cross my heart. Alright, well, I didn't need the battery in here. But I'm still gonna keep it with me just in case. Yes. 
we're only half an hour longer than the other one right now. I could stop it here and then do one for the last chapter. Even if I want to finish right now. Okay, let's do that. Alright, thank you for joining me, and I will come back very shortly for the final chapter of Dead Space, the remake.